Hey Capricorn, I hope you are doing well. This is going to be a general reading for the weekend. So this is for today, Friday, July 26th to Sunday, July 28th. Any information you need, Capricorn, you can find it in the description box down below. I do have personals open right now, but they will be closing soon, okay? Um, just for a little bit, probably until next month sometime. But uh, it's a three-question video read. It's 33:33, and you get it within two business days, okay? So details are down below, but those do close tomorrow, Saturday, July 27th at 10 p.m. Eastern time, all right? So everything's down there if you're interested. We're going to go ahead and begin here and see what we've got for Capricorn. What do we have for Capricorn? Okay. So you have the moon showing up for today's energy. So that's for Friday, um, July 26th today. And then you have the Nine of Cups showing up for Saturday's energy, July 27th. And then the uh, Page of Pentacles showing up for Sunday's energy, July 28th, okay? Now, we'll say with the moon showing up for today's energy, some of you could feel like uh, an eerie feeling or just kind of feeling like something's off in your environment and your energy here or in a conversation that you're having, maybe with a Pisces or a Cancer. Um, you could also be feeling something that's kind of how to describe this not being said you know I, I feel like you could be picking up on something that's not being verbalized here so we'll figure out what's happening with that uh, you do have that nine of cups on saturday this could be a positive support system i think that you could be feeling like back to normal on saturday that kind of energy here with the nine of cups so tomorrow could be when things kind of feel a little bit more balanced you know and i get the sense that for a small portion of you that weird energy you have today could have something to do with a dream that you had i know that sounds crazy but you could just have that you know that nasty feeling that kind of sticks with you when you have a weird uh, a weird dream I feel like some of you, it could have something to do with that because you are feeling that, or you could be feeling that it's related to something in reality somehow. And it could be for a small portion of you, but Page of Pentacles is showing up for Sunday's energy. So you could be having a conversation about work, money, discussing plans. Some of you, you could like book something, like make something official here with the Page of Pentacles energy. Like something that's non-refundable, like you end up making something official here. But for others of you, like this could be a conversation about plans, like really setting something in stone here. Or talking with a fellow earth sign in general, just back and forth messaging. What's going on with the moon for today? Why is that energy here for today? You have the Ten of Cups. Okay, so Ten of Cups energy is here. This can be happy home, happy family energy, but just happiness, emotional fulfillment in general. And I do think that this is coming from something being released, okay? Um, like you can see the couple with the arms wide open here. They're releasing all the all the cups. The cups represent emotion here. So I really do feel as if there's something that's been like buried within that's being released. I think that this could be a time where, like I said, I think it feels like a weird energy of something being below the surface here, possibly with a Pisces or Cancer or a fire sign. Let's see what else we have there for that. The Empress is showing up. A very, 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 and I mean very small portion of you. You could get news that someone in the family is pregnant today, okay, with the Empress energy showing up. I do feel like there is some good news. There's something good coming out of today's energy. Uh, some of you, you could wake up and not hear from a person for a while, and you may hear from them later on at night and, you know, be getting some sort of um, clarity on why you've not, you know, why you've not heard anything here. So I do feel like that could be something that you're a little bit concerned about, and that could be causing that mucky, eerie, like, energy with the moon because sometimes when you don't hear from a person, you can start to think the worst. First. And, you know, I do think you could be hearing back from somebody and it is making things better here, but it could be a little, just a little bit delayed. Um, we have the nine of cups showing up here for Saturday, like I said. But, you know, I really don't want to gloss over like the, the really positive energy of the Ten of Cups and the Empress showing up today um, for Friday's energy. So um, the Empress is like a card of fertility, abundance. Some of you, you could be like you could genuinely just be in a bad mood and it's possible that you get some really good news that lifts your spirits here going on with the nine of cups queen of cups energy eight of swords okay capricorn um some of you i do feel that you have a positive support system here saturday's energy feels um really good however i will say there could be one person in particular capricorn who's just not really like responsive to something good that's happening in your life or it's possible that if they are responsive they're a little bit critical of what's going on if that makes sense so it's like um you know you could be saying something like um hey i cleared things up with so and so and you know we've um you know we talked about it and 
it was a misunderstanding, blah, blah, blah. And they're like, yeah, but what about this? You, you know, like, I just feel like you're, you're dealing with someone like that. It could be a friend, you know, just maybe a concerned friend, but I'd just be careful with this energy here. Um, especially if this person has a habit of being critical when, you know, you're excited or looking forward to something. Uh, I do think this person could be feeling a little bit stuck in life. So they're critical of anyone else's forward movement. You do have the page of Pinnacle showing up for Sunday. So let's look at that energy. Capricorn, what's going on here for Capricorn? Sunday's energy with the Page of Pentacles. Queen of Swords. You guys have um, three court cards here between Saturday and Sunday. You could have a lot of like communication coming in, going out uh, on Saturday and Sunday here. But Friday looks to be the biggest day here of all, like the biggest turnaround that you didn't really uh, expect because you move from the moon card energy just feeling kind of lost, confused, into that Ten of Cups and Empress. So something does turn around. I will say on Sunday, you have the uh, Queen of Swords, Five of Swords with the uh, Page of Pentacles. I think that you're dealing with someone a little bit difficult on Sunday, like having a hard time agreeing on something here. I feel like you're trying to agree on plans of some sort. So, um, you know, I don't know what that's about, but I feel like it could be causing some sort of conflict here or it's like, um, you know, you could be trying to figure out money for a certain situation. Maybe it's for a trip. Maybe it's uh, you trying to figure out a schedule with like a boss, uh, an authority figure, or, you know, you could be discussing something with a business partner if you're a business owner. I just feel as if you're not really seeing eye to eye with a person here or they're not really communicating clearly what it is that they want on Sunday and you're a little bit frustrated about that. It's like be direct, say what you want to say. You know, like that's the energy that I feel you in. You're a little bit frustrated because I feel like you're putting ideas out there uh, or you're saying what's on your mind and somebody is just very lackluster in their responses um, or they're kind of sidestepping around what they want to say when you can kind of tell what they mean, you know. So, Weird energy, Capricorn, but that's what I got for you. Some of you, that could be a Libra or Aquarius, uh, but we do have Earth energy there as well. That's what I have for you. I hope that this was helpful or fun or whatever you needed it to be. Um, details are down below for anybody who's interested in personals. Like I said, they do close tomorrow, Saturday, July 27th at 10 p.m. Eastern time, okay? Um, it's a three-question video read. It's 33:33. You get it within two business days. And like I said, when they close, it's just going to be until like next month sometime. Um, but they are open for the time being, so everything's down there if you're interested. But if this is where we part, thank you so much for being here, Capricorn. I really appreciate you, and hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye.